some. last year when they opened but I had just gotten my beach bunnies all oh, these are my lollies but my beach bunnies and my lollies which honestly from a little kid I so I started with figure skating had a typical red L white boot I think it's like the 297 I don't really know I was a kid I didn't care it was a white boot with pink stuffer and pink laces and pink wheels and the others were all just like white or tan so I was excited but figure skating that then when I got into speed skating and switched to a derby boot, which also was a Rydell, um, I, I didn't really go back to a heeled boot until I got my beach bunnies and then got my lollies, which as you can see, I freaking love my lollies. I wear them everywhere. Freaking love them. They're the most comfortable skate I have ever skated in. Um... <laughs> So that brings me to this, I'm excited. So I have been wanting to try the Moonlight Rollers forever now. So this is my unboxing. So for my birthday this year, I did it. Um, the skate didn't really made it hard to order any other skates. So note to self that yes, I am very blessed and privileged that I have so many skates. My derby skates have now gone to my daughter. The beach bunnies are being given to my friend, which I'm actually, after this unboxing video, going to do a, um, oh my god, I'm just so geeking out. I'm like looking at the box and seeing everything it's saying, and I'm just excited. I've been watching other people's unboxing videos, like kids who watch other kids unbox stuff. <laughs> and, uh, okay, well, long story short, here we go. Anyways, I'm giving the beach bunnies to my girlfriend. Um, they were my skate park skate and I, they were great. They were a great like beginner skate, but they're super hard, super, super hard. And I'm not really into that type of hardness and I was never able to break it in and the tongue like being so thick really kind of jammed my toe box and it just wasn't my personal style of skate that I wanted to do at the skate park. I also don't really want to spend 800 at the moment on a jack boot. So here I am. I could turn this, um... Yeah, let's see if we can. I have like 10 minutes before I have to go get my son and I do want to skate in these to go get him so I can test them out. Oh, I'm freaking geeking right now. But I realized that y'all are probably not able to see me very well. So I'm gonna turn on the light here. It's gonna be bright, watch out. We'll do softer like that. There we go, much better, yay, okay. <laughs> I'm excited. So of course, gotta have a handy dandy. This is a Y3 tool, three by Y3. They do have the white four. Okay, so box is adorable, of course. Um, the moon boot, spacey. Purple's my favorite color with sparkles. Or really like black or gray scale with rainbow iridescent sparkles like space. So moon boot, way to go so far. y'all know this one says disco isn't dead normally the other one said um the call of the disco ball so this is the first one that i've actually seen that said disco isn't dead so i have a unique little box that i haven't seen before i hear that you don't have to really do anything bad with this paper like rip it or untape it because it's just a cover and i appreciate that because i too like to save my paper so fancy but isn't that cute? So yes, paper, paper. Keeps it so nice. The packaging, A plus. Holy crap. Holy crap. They send you a Y, technically a Y4 tool. Or Y, holy shit. Yes. Okay. I have never gotten this from a skate company ever. Kudos. And by the way, I just ordered these like the other day. I had saved up and saved up and saved up and saved up. And finally it happened. Holy shit. So 
I ordered these just the other day and they came immediately, like within the week, which after having waited um, eight to months to a year for my beach bunnies and my lollies, this is a big difference. And I even waited like a month for my Rydell um, R3s, which are a stock boot, they're not a custom. And so that was really exciting. And I've only ever gotten a crab tool at most in any of my, this is freaking fabulous. So I have this one, which I love, Powerdyne's 3Y tool, Y3 tool. But this is the other version that also has for the people that have the toe stop that needs the wrench, the Allen wrench to, um, to do it, which this one, oh, these are the upgraded plates. That's right. So I need this tool to do my stopper. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Oh, okay. So y'all want to see them? <laughs> So laces, of course, which I'm gonna, I'm gonna change. Just be realistic, I'm gonna change those. Everything about your moon boot, which you've seen probably in other boxing. Oh my God, I have to like go get my fun and I wanna just sit here and open this. Okay, so of course you get fun stickers. Totally gonna rock this sticker, hell yes. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so freaking excited. <laughs> oh my god i love it okay so i got the chartreuse like lime green with the little moon so everyone mentioned that they smelled like like the wheels kind of have that you're thinking oh look at that look at how they roll Oh my God, so this plate, they used to have the aluminum alloy plate. This honestly feels like a steel plate boot. Has um, actually nicer cushions in it too. Oh, I love this skate so much. It's so soft. It has the little moonlight toe stop. Oh, wow. Oh, I can't wait to put this on. Okay, so the insole is a little bit um, different than what I'm used to with the lollies. I'm not gonna pull it out. I don't wanna like mess anything up. So it's like little moon phases on the inside. The moon boot, it's super, um, so it's still soft as y'all seen, um, but it's not like, um, lolly soft and it's not super hard like the um, bunny or the jungle or the panther they're vegan style hard basic boot now their vegan jack is a different like vegan vinyl which is a lot softer um, I have a very strong feeling this is gonna be my favorite skate oh my god I fucking love it Okay, very different in the plate that I've ever seen before, but it's, it's on there pretty well. Okay, one thing I do love, so like my lollies, as you can see, um, they're glued. They're not sewn or stitched. Nothing against that. I fucking love my lollies. It's also a nylon, that's the nylon thrust plate, the Powerdyne nylon thrust plate. So like nylon and plastic fiber, whatever you compound. Ooh, there's lots of padding on this inside. Oh, I cannot wait. So I have to go get my son before I can like come try these on. But little perks that I like, I love this curved heel. I love that they're a stitched sole. I love that the toe stop is Allen wrenched in there. These are a hybrid wheel, which I love. I'm probably gonna change them out depending what I'm doing, but I'm gonna rock these for now, just outdoor and skating. They're so cute with a little moon on them and they say moonlight roller. Um, they feel very similar to Grindstone's Smokehouse wheel, which is a, um, I believe it's like an 85A, between an 82 to an 85A hardness. And these are 57 mil millimeters. So their quality control, keeping this this is a fucking amazing fresh out of the box book. I don't mean to cuss so much, but God bless this. Hello, Moonlight calling. And I'm answering. <laughs> like, 
I cannot wait. I called to the disco ball. Okay. Well, I'm gonna lace this bad boy up. They have Abex seven bearings in them and they're super clean, which I believe my Molly's, um, I need to check, but I believe my Molly's came with the Abex fives or the Abex sevens, either or. Um, but basic, pretty nice you know, bearing. The cushions look nice. Everything looks really soft and nice. I just have to go get my son. I cannot believe that this came with all it came with for one. That's, I love y'all. And I know that it's gonna be amazing on my foot. I just know everything about it's gonna be perfect and I cannot fucking wait to get back and do a video on that. <laughs>